L for Lord, L for light, L for life, L for liberty. The Lord Jesus, who is the capital L, came to give us liberty, to give us the light, to give us life eternal. And then after he done what he did on the cross, he came back and he said, now you have the second letter O, you have an obligation to take my love with you. And wherever you go, carry this love. Fear not for the one who is in you, much greater than the one who is in the world. Because I crush Satan and whoever makes Satan their God, then let them know that their God is under the foot of your God. And his name is Jesus Christ of Nazareth. You have an obligation to take this love, which is life, which is liberty, which is light, which is the Lord himself. Take it to the world and engage in this battle based on love, not hatred, based on love and true genuine love who came down from heaven. Take this love and engage in this battle to take the love to a place that lacks love altogether. They will fight against you. But remember, when you have Christ with you, the end result is already predetermined before you even begin the battle. And that end result is V for victory. And unless you are victorious, you can never be rewarded. And unless you engage in a battle, you can never find out if you were ever victorious. And unless you have the Lord with you, don't ever engage in no battle. Because without the Lord, you will definitely fail. But when the Lord is with you, then go and engage in that battle of love. Because the end result is victory. And when you are victorious, the final reward will come with the capital E, eternity. This is your home. This is the kingdom of your father, which was, which was made for you before the creations of the world. Inherit the kingdom of your father, which is eternal life. E, eternity. L, life. I am the beginning and the end. I am the alpha and the omega. I am the first and the last. 